and I'm back with another video guys today. Today we're gonna be doing a challenge me video number whatever it is. I finally got my face cam to lag, stop lagging at least. Hopefully it doesn't lag, hopefully it doesn't stop. I know my hair looks stupid. Happy Mother's Day to you guys all, that's when I'm recording this. We have to get 15 headshots with the MR6 pistols dual wield. So that's what I'm gonna be trying to do here as you guys can see. Uh, hopefully my thing doesn't lag out mid thing. So Bubby joined the party, I'm gonna tell him to fuck off real quick. Bubby, fuck off, I'm gonna make a video. Yep, you guys saw that, sorry. Okay, so we're gonna be playing on Stronghold Free For All. We're gonna be using glitch just to get out of s sticky situations. Uh, I don't know how I feel about this camera angle. I got a bunch of shit in the background, so hopefully that doesn't look too weird. My hair is all weird too, I, I was wearing a hat. Uh, I have people in my game, so. I'm gonna start a party real quick. Like I said, no editing. This is just gonna be full on straight commentary, try to get some headshots. Don't think I'm gonna do it, but the challenge is if I don't get these headshots, uh, I think I was reading it, I have to empty a water bottle, fill it with a little bit of ketchup, fill it back with water, put G Fuel in it, and then drink it. I. That's if I don't get 15 headshots with dual wheeled pistols. Keep in mind, you cannot aim in pistols. Both triggers are occupied by both weapons. Therefore, I will not be able to log in. I don't think I have to win the free for all. I could be wrong. I'm just gonna aim for the headshots if I don't win. Fuck it. I really don't give a shit. Oh my god. It's gonna be so hard. I'm just gonna try to go for headshots. Not focus on the headshots, just focus on winning the game. Hopefully, I just get the headshots randomly. I haven't played Black Ops 3 in a minute. It's been a while, actually. That's one headshot. On Ajax, fuck, dude. Or I don't know what the gun that is, but that's one of the new DSC weapons. Hopefully, uh, he doesn't bother us all that much with that weapon. There's still people using the Brecci. What a surprise, right? I think all Call of Duty avid players are not surprised at all by Brecci's anymore. I'm not at least. See, the, the pistol isn't that bad. The dual pistols aren't that bad at all. It's just the headshot aspect of the challenge. So I don't think I'm gonna catch so you guys. I'm gonna get some some uh, you know nice camera quality images of me probably throwing up. I can't imagine those tastes that tastes good at all. Ketchup, water, G fuel. Oh my god! How did I realize it? It sounds horrendous. Nope. He's got that one charge up weapon. Got dark matter. I don't know if I want to go for dark matter in this game. Uh, I think I already have snipers finished, uh, shotguns, SMGs, LMGs, I think I have them finished, I don't think so. But I, I could never get long shots with the ARs in this game since all the maps are pretty small. But I'll just probably look up how to get long shots with ARs on BO3. Uh, let's see what happens there. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, chapter first, this game has a bunch of good players. Fuck, dude, I slid, god damn it. Probably not helping my hair at all. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, just came from breakfast, Mother's Day breakfast, you already know. Uh, ah, fuck, dude, I still I can't do it. I don't think I'm gonna be able to do this, to be honest. Okay, so we're not leaving. There's a guy with 11 kills. Probably a guy with the Brecci. Dude, why did, Black Ops 3 just seems so much faster than IW, like the sliding and all that stuff. Accelerator, let's glitch out of there. And, nope, Brecci's keen. Can't get past that motherfucker. I actually miss playing BO3 a lot, actually. I don't know if I want to come back to it and try to get Dark Matter. I, I, I could try. It'd be like the first game, or like, I'd try to get like the, the end camo, end camo you can call it, on every Call of Duty. So like Dark Matter, BO3, Solar, Slash Black Sky, IW, uh, Exclusion Zone, MWR, and I'm pretty sure every Call of Duty from now on is gonna have that, unless, uh, World War II keeps it very like simplistic and like time stamps historical. I don't fucking know. So I might go for Dark Matter here just for the fuck of it. Uh, I can reach to like level 500 since it's like basically uh, double XP all the time on this game. And there's a fucking Guardian. I hate those ever since BO2. I fucking hate that. Let's see if I can just go here. I don't have the silence because I have to put gumbo. So I have Dead Silence and then, uh, Last Person. Dude, what the fuck is that gun? I'm gonna watch this. 
This fucking gun, dude. No skill. It takes absolutely no skill. It just takes patience. Okay. Can go last something for that. Two guardians. Who the fuck puts two guardians? That's like crazy. Just making sure my thing. You see me look over to the left. Obviously, you guys know that. Or left, my left, your right. I don't know. I'm looking at the monitor, making sure my fucking face cam doesn't freeze, because it has been freezing so much lately. I'm just gonna get the fuck out of there. Still didn't work. Do got MR6. I'm not looking for this end challenge. I really am not. SPO3 so much, dude. This game's so fun. I might come back to it now that I'm done with IW. Once I get Exclusion Zone on, uh, what's it called? MWR. I'm probably gonna get Dark Matter since the community on this game is still very much alive, and this is probably the last summer that it's gonna be alive. The dying summer, some may call it, for every Call of Duty. The second summer it's out is always this dying summer. People don't play this game as much anymore, so I'm gonna try to take advantage of the slower lobbies, the less sweaty lobbies. And Try to get that exclusion zone. I mean, exclusion zone. Dark matter, uh, finally. And then hopefully I get exclusion zone by that time. I'm not gonna win this free for all at all. I'm not gonna, I'm not even close to the headshot challenge, so. Rip. A uh, shout out to Readers on Buzz for giving me this insane fucking challenge. Actually, not a shout out to you. I fucking hate you. Uh, I'll leave this channel in the description. You guys can go dislike every video and as well as flag all of this content. I just saw a guy. Actually, YouTube doesn't let you actually promote, or is that Twitch that doesn't let you promote hating on other channels? It might be Twitch. I might stream more, because like, YouTube's on, and I try to make this like a hobby that makes money for me, but obviously you need like 10,000 views, and I'm still working at that before I like, get money for it, but, ah, fuck. One last kill until we're finished. We're gonna pull out the camera. There we go. This is not gonna be fun at all. I'm sorry. Anybody who thought. This is game type. Tengo la nuke, pero no su armora. He has a nuke, but not a love? Armor? I don't know. I play with, for some reason, I play with Mexican servers. Anyway. We're gonna play, uh, we're gonna, not gonna play, we're gonna get a camera and do this shit. Hopefully it's not too bad. So as you guys can see, I did not complete my challenge. I only got three headshots that last game that we played. So, what that means is that we're probably gonna have to get water. Well, this is shit lighting. We're gonna have to get water, a water bottle at least, empty it, put ketchup in it, fill it back with water, and then put G Fuel, mix it up, drink it. This is not gonna be fun. Very disgusting. I'm probably gonna go outside just in case I throw up. And it's easier to just like spray it off the patio than it is to like clean it off the tile that I have. So hopefully it's not too bad. Yo, Gus, you wanna do this challenge with me like we did last time? No, you're fucking gay. Get out. For my own safety and my own liking, I'm probably just gonna get like a red G Fuel. Hopefully it doesn't taste too bad. Uh, if you see me looking to the side, it's because I'm looking at my little thingy over here. Let's get some G Fuel. So we got our Phase Berry G Fuel. I really don't want to waste it all that much in the water over there, so hopefully we don't use all that much. So that's half the water bottle as you guys can see. This is a weird angle. So I'm gonna get like the shitty ketchup out of this thing over here and then put it in there. That should be great. Let's get the shitty part out of it though. Okay, so we got ketchup open. I'm gonna put it in the water. Um, oh, that looks disgusting. Oh no, it got all cold. Okay, that's enough ketchup. That's disgusting. Put that away. Let's put some G Fuel in it. Uh, I hate life. 
Put a little bit of G Fuel, not that much of G Fuel. Put it in there. I probably should have had the, the little funnel thingy. But it's all good. Take it. Oh no. I don't know why. I decided to put the G Fuel in the fridge and that didn't work. So I'm gonna go to the sink and do this and then I'll shake it up for you. Okay. Moment of truth. We got our G Fuel water bottle and ketchup at the bottom. Oh shit, I didn't close all the way, hold on. It's open. Oh, there's chunks of ketchup in there, look at this. Let's see if I can get it close, close. Focus. Close, focus, question mark. Come on camera. Yeah. This looks absolutely disgusting. The original ch challenge was with mayonnaise and ketchup. But I don't have mayonnaise since I don't eat mayo and none of my family eats mayo for whatever reason. So hopefully this doesn't taste bad, dude. I think my stomach is so weird right now. I don't want to do this. I'm gonna go outside and do this so I don't throw up all over in here. Okay, so we are now outside. We got our concoction. Um, ketchup kind of disintegrated into the G Fuel. There's a little bit less um, like particles in here. So you guys can see. Not that much from the last time. I guess I was just shaking it. Um, oh man. Here goes nothing. G Fuel Ketchup Water Challenge. It's not that bad. I'm taking baby sips though. How it tastes? It tastes like bubblegum. Basically just bubblegum. Bubblegum G Fuel. <coughs> that was a ketchup joke. I just got a ketchup chunk. I'm gonna need some mints after this. Holy fuck. But if you guys wanna try it, it tastes like bubblegum G Fuel. Just make sure there's no ketchup chunks in there. Oh my god, that was horrific. <coughs> but yeah, I'm gonna throw this off the mountain. If you guys are hearing anything, that is the wind and my my fountain to my pool. And there's a pool behind me, or in front of me, anyway. Yeah, that's been the challenge, guys. Uh, this is taste like shit. Uh, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.